Bench rolling up. Do our best, bro. You know what we about to do. Man, look at some weed shit, bro. Take a look, bro. New at five tonight, Atlanta police shut down another drug operation. Well, investigators say this one operated out of a Southside motel, and that fact elevated the need for the tactical team to be precise and show overwhelming force because they suspected their targets would be well armed. Are more so these niggas. Okay, well, they, they describe this shit as a drug den. Why? why? A drug den. So, so what do they have in there? What do they have on in there? Now, this was in my weed feed, so so I imagine they had weed in there, but I'm pretty sure they probably had other shit in there too. Stiggs has obtained the body camera footage, and he has this exclusive. Darren Cheerbomb, the Atlanta chief, is focusing on closing drug merchants down and taking their weapons. He says, wherever there is a drug business, there's likely to be violence, and he doesn't want innocent people to be caught. In Why do you say that? Wherever there's a drug business, there's likely to be violence? Well... We can't we can't say it's 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 a stereotype, but it's a stereotype, but it's not it's not it's not wrong. It's not wrong. In a crossfire. Oh, hands up, hands up, hands coming up, hands coming up. Atlanta officers conduct a sensitive operation at a small south side motel. Part of the psychology behind these tactical op This is a motel. That should look like a project. Well, I guess those Doors are too close together to be a project. ...is to have an overwhelming show of force. The suspects sold drugs out of an apartment, according to APD. Getting these suspects to comply, realizing that if they fight, this is not a fight that they're going to win. Here is some of what... Dude, that, that's crack. That's crack. And it's a lot. There's niggas still buying crack. Who's still doing crack in this world, bruh? I didn't know crack was still still a drug of choice for anybody. Customers had purchased, according to the police intelligence, crack cocaine, marijuana, a business that carried on for at least two months. Two months? These niggas had all the guns. This is a Draco. Uh, these two nines. Uh, a two, two, three. Uh, that's a A or that's that's probably not a two, two, three. This nigga had the drum joint. These niggas was ready for anything. Two handguns and three rifles. And those confiscated guns key to Chief Shearbaum's charge to his troops to go after gangs, guns, and drugs. Taken into custody on drug and weapons charges are DeAndre Royster, Keonti Smith, and Isaiah Burt, the last man with the lengthiest record, 21 arrest cycle. What, bro? Yo, you can't, yo, that's why, bro, yo, you can't be playing with niggas with glasses, bro. <laughs> niggas with glasses, bro. Bro, fuck you up, bro. We knew there would be a lot of people out there, and we knew that there would be a lot of people out there who weren't necessarily involved. So that includes bringing uh, in some extra personnel. And you can see by the body camera video uh, that the officers were taking their time. They were working from a position of advantage. The drug investigations, they are time consuming a minimum of several weeks to complete. To this point in the year, they have served 51 warrants and they have confiscated 57 weapons from Southwest Atlanta. I'm more. 57 weapons, but that right there was just five of them. Yeah, that was five of them right Diggs, there. Fox 5 News.
Yeah, so that was like that was what basically one one eleventh of them. What does that be? That this this year y'all y'all got that we just go by each arrest doing that. Y'all got eleven arrests for the year. It's not big numbers, but all right. It's 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 uh it's drugs off the street. You know what I'm saying? Long long as drugs off the street, we we had no we had no we we ain't we ain't worrying about we ain't, yeah we ain't complaining about that. I mean, long as long as, well, them niggas did take some weed off the street. But that crack, that crack, they can keep that, that weed, though. Somebody could smoke that. 